talk about this. Okay. Okay din. Basta hindi rin. Ito. Ito hindi rin. Pero okay yung story. Hindi ko alam dito to. I know that he has family. Family? Family. Oh. I think he's done. Broken heart. Mm-hmm. Yeah, pero, okay. pero medyo personal siya. Sana yeah, mapasabi natin. Ay, umi. I think our next victim has the letter L. And naka stripes. And naka. <laughs> come here, Laziz. Come here. I I want I want it na us lang. Yes. Can we talk? So, Laziz. Can we talk? Okay. Hindi naman. Come. Where will we go though? Any anything, guys. Dun na lang. Dun na lang. Et. You're in the middle here. Hindi naman tayo makikinig eh. May ice cream. <laughs> si nag workout Si Michael, si Isabel, ka? Nathan. <laughs> Why are you your, giggling? What's your definition? That, that would be a lot of cringe. <laughs> Brother, what's your definition of love? Okay, wait. Let's formally introduce ourselves. I am Zach Cupido. And I'm Zach Cupido. And together and we, we are, are the Cupido. Duo. Cupido. 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 Okay. Yes. Hello. Hello. So, Laziz. First Laziz, question. The first question to you. What, what is love? Love. Love is everything. <laughs> <laughs> love. It's motivation. And love is. Uh, Chemical, um, chemical the reaction. chemical reaction that human cannot do anything. That's I think what make us different uh, from all the other love. Love makes human. Yeah. That's true. So That's very true. We all know that here that you really love your family. Mm-hmm. How do you show your love to your mom and your siblings? Siempre. Uh, care, a lot of care, uh, provide what they need, uh, protect, mm. and, must, and most important, uh, worry, uh, sacrificing my life for them. Because mm. I don't see many other reasons that could make me move or work or do something. It's just love. Loving them, that makes me move, work, do something, uh, achieve something. Mm. I think that's... Do you love yourself when you're sacrificing things for your family? Hmm. I, I mean, I'm proud of myself that I can do that, uh, but limited. I'm like my mom mostly, selfless. Sometimes. Mm. Um, pero you do everything for your family. Yes, everything. Ready to die for them. What made you become this way? Like, when did it start? How how did you develop this deep of a love for your family? Yes. Siempre, um, for love, like, many people think, what makes you, like, love your mom so much? Pero... I think to love mom, no need reasons at mm. the first place. Like to others, yeah, there is reasons. But for mom, like, this is the person who gives you life. Mm. And then, yeah, God created us, but our moms give us life. Yeah, that's So true. there is, should be no reasons to love your mom at, f- at the first place. Mm. Doesn't matter how they act, what they say. And second, <laughs> It's just one addition, your one family that you can have. Yeah. And okay. there is, will be no other chance. Better do something and regret That's than true. do nothing and regret also. So That's I choose 
help them. Sempre my mom also work hard, sacrifice her life for us. Uh, she didn't thought of herself. She didn't uh, think of herself. She always put us as a priority, mm. and I appreciate it a lot. And sempre I wanna return everything what she's done and give. So. I'm sure you did that and more. I did only maybe 10%. Mm -hmm. uh, <laughs> no, I think I think your family appreciates everything that you do for yes. them. So that's good. Uh, we keep on hearing your stories about your yeah. mom and your siblings. siblings. Yeah. Are you comfortable to talk about your father? Yeah, sure. Yeah, sure. I'm comfortable no to talk about anything you guys want. How is your relationship with your father? To be honest, for me it's empty because mm. I never see that person mm. when I was really ready in my mind. Because the last time I saw him I was really little. Mm. Maybe I was nine years old or eight years old. Mm. And it was only once and last. So, mm -hmm. And then, to be honest, I didn't know who really is he. Who it was at that it time. Was Do that you want time. to know him? Sempre, like, there is no, no, no such a feeling that, uh, because mm, my mom replaced mm. father and her, 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 to father I just want to, for example, ask a few questions, like why, for example, but the way mom said about him, the way mom think, like, uh, sempre I'm thankful also for, for the life. But just sometimes I want to ask a few questions like why why, and how, what, what, what happened. Even, for example, no need to support, no need anything. Just you just want to know. Just want to know. But I, I grew up without these feelings that he is there. If, mm. if, for example, I grew up with him and he left, yeah, maybe it would be different, difficult. And I would miss and love. But if I grew up without him, for me, it's just a secret. Mm -mm. So she provided for you anyway. So yeah, when 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 he left, she, she had to sold two properties, our properties, mm. because she couldn't work because I was breastfeeding. Uh, mm. She was the breastfeeding of me. I was still baby. Mm. And then two races, she she had to sell many properties and many mm. of her stuff because she she was very depressed and stressed and. Yeah, I think, um, of course, I want to respect him, but... Are I you mad at him right now? Or not really mad, it's just not really manly, what he's done. Yeah, mm. that's... Yeah. Um, sempre, like, life, yeah, without him, it, it wasn't be me here sitting, but uh, it's not manly. At, all. at least if you cannot do, just talk or say something, at least say sorry. So it doesn't matter what's happening. But, but to be honest, I don't know. But, for example, I know his address, I know where he lives, I know I have siblings. Mm. But my mom always said that he will come to you. Mm -hmm. The fact that uh, you don't know, you, I mean, you, you're not in communication with your father, does that make you your heart clear or something something's missing or empty or are you broken hearted by like, that fact yes in school they used to almost all of my schoolmates they used to have a father mm. and for me it was sad because for example when somebody gonna pick them up i walk home alone <laughs> and then many of them used to ask or sometimes bully where is your father or what happened Mm. And if I ask mom, she just jokes and says, say he's dead. Oh my god! <laughs> Sometimes ah. into some papers she say that because Shempre it was fresh that yeah. time. Yeah. But before I, it was kind of hard for me. Yeah. And then and then my mom also couldn't come. And some, when I was growing up, it was very difficult because uh, I needed somebody to come to do school, be proud, for example. In some subjects, we do some flowers or create something, and the parents would come and pick it, pick it up, or celebrate with them. Mm. But uh, me, I always wait until all parents go, and then I walk home. But uh, that time, yes, it was difficult because uh, mm, 
I wanted to also feel that there is somebody or something. Mm. But I had my sisters, but we all, there is, I grew up with women, like my Lola, Nana, two Ate, so, and you boy, and it's hard to sometimes talk to them, to have, to have mm. connection. To look, to look up to like your father. Yeah, mm. th that's what built in me, I think. It broke me before, but no. now I realize, and after years I realize many things. So, and I see always my mom She's having a hard time, mm -hmm. and then I, I, I always wanted to su support or help. So the time when, when you see your mom sad, that makes you broken hearted too? Super. Make, that make you sad too? That's, mm -hmm. that's what makes me always move. Until now she's still going through. No, no, no. Like she's okay now. She, she's uh, until after 15. After I was 15, I already stopped um, everything and completely blow away mm. for me. So if she have uh, any problems or something, I would fix it, mm. even for my sisters. No, oh, you're so selfless, and we always admire that from you because you sacrifice a lot for your family. Mm -hmm. And I'm sure they're proud of everything that you've done for them. And imagine from Uzbekistan, you, yeah, you go you to the Philippines here. for them, for the sacrifice of your family. Thank but, you so much. But I'm thankful here because mm. this has become like a se second home, Philippines first, because I was 18 when I come here. Mm. And you know, when you try something first time, it's mm. the most memorable. Mm. Yeah. So everything I tried and learned, it was Philippines, like language, um, food, mm -mm. beaches, culture. places, culture. Pusong Pinoy. Are you a Pusong Pinoy? Always. <laughs> I'm proud where I came from, but yeah. I'm comfortable here. Not, thank you for sharing. Thank How about? You for sharing. Yeah, you can. Uh, How about? The romantic, the romantic department. Ooh. Do you want to share? Yes. <laughs> yes. <laughs> tell us what you want to tell us. Because <laughs> you know, in my country, Muslim country, you cannot talk to girls properly, mm. and you cannot experience much because yeah. because of culture. Yeah. Mm -mm. And then I'm really mature enough, and I in love with a Filipina here first time first love until now so yeah yeah look at his face <laughs> killing car <laughs> so for me i was really mature i started to realize lately like didn't understand get mad on something not worth it but um, i understand and it changed me a lot to be honest i was more difficult person yeah, and I think love, that's what makes people change. Aww. If you could say anything... Anything, like you can what? ask questions. If you could say anything to your girlfriend right now, what would it be? I love you. Yeah. <laughs> 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 Miss Nakita. Anong tawagan ninyo? How do you call each other? Baby ko. Baby ko. Or cupcake. 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 Outside, I'm very different, but inside, there is... No, we know you're a good boy. Yeah. You're a really good guy. Who else? But <laughs> thank you so much for sharing your story. Do you want to say something? Yeah, like, I'm not really, like, oh, perfect, good. There is many bad sides, yeah. also. But uh, what, what you guys see, good sides on me, it's for my mom or from my mom. But uh, mm. I know there is many... Minuses as well. Yeah. Mm -hmm. We all have the yeah, no positives and negatives. Mm -hmm. Also, loving, if I love somebody, I will love until death. For example, even my birds, my parrots. I, for example, 
spoiler alert. <laughs>